Can you say that into the camera Let's one more time? Let's get a third murder mystery going, and I need Jeremy here to direct it. He's fantastic. Scott Stuber, you hear that? Jeremy, everything that I loved about the first murder mystery, you guys amp it up in this one. Thank you. Talk to me. How do you approach a sequel and capture and establish capture the established uh, tone of the first one, but makes it feel original and uh, and just up everything? Well, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Uh, you know, we, I I don't know many good comedy sequels. I haven't seen many good comedy sequels. So when I had the opportunity to do this. I really wanted to, to this to be a standalone movie. So I approached it as if you didn't need to see the first film. Um, and I wanted to make sure that we're establishing these characters, we're establishing what their issues are. And, you know, maybe the genre is going to be bending a little bit more. Uh, we're going to have action. We're going to have more romance. Um, but you still keep the, the, the tone of, of the, first, the first film and what was created by, by, by Kyle and James. Um, so, yeah, that's how I approached it, and, and I'm, I'm really proud, and I think uh, people are going to enjoy this movie. Yo, let's not sleep on the action, because the action in this movie is top-notch, especially that, that there's this great scene on the Eiffel Tower, amazing job. Can you talk to me about approaching the action sequences, working with Jennifer and Adam? They're not used to, or known for doing much of that action stuff, but they're great in it. Well, thank you. I wanted there to be a ton of action in this movie. I love, I love action movies, um, and I, because I've, been mainly uh, in the comedy world. Sure. I haven't really had the opportunity, and uh, when I wrote a lot of that action into the script, I was kind of hoping that like, people would like it. Um, and they were like, it. and they were like, "Great, we love it." And I'm like, "Okay, I guess we're gonna make this." Um, we put together the most amazing team of, of second unit directors, stunt team. Uh, JJ Cooper, Spiro, I did that van sequence, um, and. We just, we boarded everything. We edited it a hundred times before we actually went and shot it. Um, I would show Adam and Jen the edited animatics so they could actually watch the, sure. like, the full sequence before they even, like, so they had an understanding of the context. Um, and they were game. They had so much fun. You know, they love their their uh, stunt. They always have fun, like, banter with their stunt uh, doubles. Um, who who are just just incredible um, and yeah it was fun it was it was great. Paris is one of my favorite cities in the world and you guys really captured the, it almost feels like Paris is its own character in this film. You guys really capture the charm. Can you talk to me about the energy that the city brought to the shoot? The idea of being able to shoot at the Paris Opera or the Arc de Triomphe or the uh, the Eiffel Tower or the Chateau like. The opportunity to go shoot in those places was just, in, it was it was incredible. Uh, there's so much history. Uh, it's the city of, of, of romance and love. Um, and people love Adam and Jen all over the world. So there, we, we were able to get more access, I think, uh, than, than a, a typical film. Um, and the, the, the Parisian crew, were, they were incredible. Um, there's such a rich cinematic history in France and um, so much talent. And they would have wine and cheese at the end of uh, every, every day at the end of the set, which was, which was awesome. Um, and yeah, I'd love to, to, to go back and spend more time enjoying Paris uh, w instead of just working. Well, look, Jeremy, amazing job on this film. I'm really hoping that you direct the third one because uh, I can't wait for a, for a three-peat three on the murder mysteries, man. These are amazing. Can you say that into the camera Let's one more time? Let's get a third murder mystery going, and I need Jeremy here to direct it. He's fantastic. Scott Stuber, you hear that? Thanks, man. I appreciate your time, bro. Thanks, man. Mm -hmm.